What's up everybody, Alex here, and today we're looking at Ping Pong VR. Now, as you can see, I'm pretty excited. This is going to be a commentary video because, quite frankly, uh, look how awesome that paddle looks, but the, uh, the I couldn't get the audio to sound right, so I'm going to do a little bit of commentary while I play some Ping Pong. Now, um, you'll see I'm selecting a moderate difficulty. That's because I quickly learned that if you pick up on a very high difficulty, these guys will destroy you. So we're in some sort of, uh, not a dojo, but it's like an outdoors dojo almost, and... Uh, Honestly, you'd be surprised how intuitive this is. Now, um, you know, the one thing about VR that a lot of people, you know, might take issue with is the fact that you don't have that that physical, uh, you know, legitimate feel of doing something. But this game does a really good job of making you feel like you're playing ping pong. I mean, the uh, force haptic feedback from the controller does a great job on impact with the ball. Uh, you obviously don't feel the weight of the ball, but the, uh, the force feedback gives you a little bit of feedback that helps you to kind of judge, you know, when you're making good contact, etc. Uh, the speed of which you swing does impact the speed of the ball. Uh, the, the physical seem pretty solid honestly and as you can see as I rally to a win there I'm 6-0 um, you know uh, the game actually does do a really good job of being intuitive now that's just some bad play right there I've never I've borderline never played ping pong before so um, if you are super good at ping pong oh wow good job Alex yeah yeah so, but the uh, the idea here is <laughs> what I try and do put a spin on it I, I don't know what I was trying to do there but um if you're good at ping pong, you're probably good at this game, honestly, because um, it is legitimately ping pong in VR. Did I hit the ceiling there? I'm not sure. Anyways, um, but as you can see, you know, it, it is intuitive. It's a lot of fun. And, uh, you know, I'm playing on an HTC Vive, the original, and, um, you know, it, it, it looks good. It feels good. And it's something that uh, I think that if you're into ping pong, uh, you definitely should consider playing. Uh, it does have a bunch of uh, other modes as well, which I'll get into later in the video. Yeah, that's a good win there. Uh, now it's 8-8. I can't believe... Listen, I had a 6 nothing lead on this guy. 6 nothing, And now it's 9-8. So I, this is unbelievable. I'm actually falling apart, to be honest with you. All right. Here we go. One more point. But I'm probably going to mess it up, aren't I? There's a good chance I messed it up. Oh, no, I won. I was not expecting to win. So I'm just taking in the scenery, I guess. But as you can see, the game is really nice. Oh, that was just the first set. Oh, see, I can't even remember. I can't even remember. Oh, look at that. That was an ace serve right underneath the, uh, right above the, the net there. A little bit of a curve on the ball, too. But, um... You get a you get a feel for this game in a way that you know you you don't usually expect because um, you know VR can be somewhat intimidating for some people. Um, you know it's uh, it just it takes a lot of practice. Like it's a very physical thing. Like if you're playing, like I'm throwing the ball way up now, and it's funny because I'm just showing you that you know it is extremely responsive to how you play the game physically. Like if you you want to you know put the ball up really high and really slam it down or you want to you know go really fast or whatever you know you can do that the game like that again I'm not putting enough on it there the game is very responsive so I guess I don't even know the rules of ping pong am I do I have to make it hit the ground on my side I guess I do I was unaware of that oh it's not even my turn <laughs> it's not even my turn I'm swinging for it all right so far oh wow the serving should be the, the easiest part, and I can't even handle that. Oh, what a win off the top of the net. That's right. Oh, man, I locked a paddle. Let's check that out, maybe. But anyway, so I wanted to show you guys the arcade modes here. There's a whole bunch. So you can do, you know, just wall tennis type thing and just to practice. Um, I like the, uh, the hit the point. I thought this was pretty neat. Um, it kind of... Again, as someone who's really bad at ping pong, I felt that it really helped me to... Get better, so you got to be precise. The robot moves, and you have to hit the target. And the more precise we are, the more points we get. And as you can see, there's going to be a target on the uh, the field of play there. And <laughs> it totally took me by surprise that the ball came right to my chest. I was in a, a bad position. But now uh, I'm a little off camera there, but that's because the ball literally went square to my chest. So there we go. So now uh, trying to get into that little zone. And if you're into that bullseye, you get more points, obviously. And I am not doing a good job at... Oh, there's one. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. But, again, like, if you're really into VR and you're really into ping pong, then suddenly, like, you find yourself, like, a game like this, a little mini game where you have to, like, finesse the ball into a target, it would not be fun and it wouldn't work if it... Well, if it didn't work. The idea that the game is as responsive as it is really helps to have mini games like this because 
they are fun. Like, in fact, I actually enjoyed this mini game more than I did the actual, you know, table tennis part, the ping pong, so to speak. Um, because it was just, it's just me. It's less pressure. You know, you're almost playing against yourself to beat your high score. And I felt like I was getting better. You know, 614 is obviously a terrible score. I'm sure you guys would be capable of better. But for me, it's not that bad. And, uh, you know, hey, look at that guy. Yes. Yes. That's right. That's right. I'm good at table pit tennis. All right, so here we go. Uh, this is another mini game where it kind of just, you know, knocks out, uh, you know, blocks as you play. I thought it was okay. It wasn't quite what I was looking for, but, oh, bad serve. Come on, Alex. Learn how to serve. And then, uh, you know, this, and again, I just wanted to show you this so you have an idea of what's in the game and what's available to you. I didn't enjoy that much as much, uh, that mode as much, sorry. And then there's bowling, so calm down, hit them all. How many can you hit with 25 balls? Let's see how I do. I got that new paddle I unlocked. Um, there's the cans. That's not a good start. Also not a good start. And yes, knocked all the... Yo, oh, you've got to be kidding me. So that one stayed up. That's unbelievable. And I'm sure now I'm going to have a hard time getting that can down. Oh, that was so close. Come on, Alex. No pressure. Yes. Hey, listen, that's way harder than it. What? No one's cheering for. Okay, there we go. There we go. Thank you for that support. Um, this is way harder than it looks, by the way. Uh, the target game's a little easier because of the surf from the robot. But as you can see, oh, wow, on the ground. On the ground again! Here we go. So I don't know if I'm going to be very successful here. Uh, I'm going to run out of balls soon. Oh, I'm just wasting them. Unbelievable. Oh, okay, cut this. This is embarrassing. Anyways, guys, this is VR Ping Pong. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Check it out. I'll put a link in the description below. It's available on Steam. So uh, thank you for watching. Have yourselves a wonderful day. And until next time.